Hello and welcome back to New Tech. In this video, we will explore one of the most important topics in electronic communication, the basic communication system block diagram. Whether you are a student, hobbyist or preparing for exams, this is a must know concept. Let's dive in. Why communication is important? From making phone calls to streaming videos, every signal you send or receive goes through a communication system. Understanding how it works helps you appreciate the magic behind our modern digital world. Let's see basic block diagram of communication system consists of six essential blocks information source, transmitter, channel, noise, receiver and destination. Let's go through each one step by step. See detailed block by block explanation. First information source. This is where the message originates. It can be anything, your voice, a text message, a sensor reading or even a video. The source converts this into electrical signal or digital data. Second, transmitter. The transmitter processes the signal to make it suitable for transmission. It may include amplification, encoding and modulation. For example, if we are transmitting audio or radio, the signal is modulated combined with high frequency carrier wave so it can travel long distances. Let's see channel and noise. The channel is a physical medium. The signal travels through it. It could be air for radio signals, optical fiber for light, cables for electrical signal. Unfortunately, no channel is perfect. Noise. Unwanted disturbances can enter during transmission. This noise may cause distortion, delay or loss of signal. Let's see receiver. The receiver's job is to recover the original message from the received signal. It uses demodulation and decoding to eliminate the effects of modulation and extract the clean message. And the last block, destination. The final block is the destination where the signal reaches its user. In phone calls, it's your ear. In digital communication, it's a computer or display. The goal, deliver the intended message as accurately as possible. Let's see real life example. Let's take a mobile phone call as an example. You speak into your phone is the information source. The phone encodes and transmits it is a transmitter. The signal travels through the air is a channel. The signal is received and decoded by the other phone at the receiver. Your voice is played in the speaker is a destination. Any static or drop in the call that is the effect of noise. Let's quickly recap some key terms. Modulation, adding a message signal to a carrier wave. Noise, any unwanted signal that affects quality. Channel, the medium through which signal travels. Demodulation, extracting message from carrier. These are the backbone of any communication system. To summarize, a basic communication system sends information from source to destination using a transmitter, channel and receiver, all while trying to overcome noise. If you are a student, Practice drawing the block diagram and explaining each part and at the end, if you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so you never miss a lesson. Drop your questions in the comments. I reply to everyone. Enjoy.